the ugly side of being a flight attendant, okay? This is it. Real and raw and cut. This is what can happen. So, hey y'all, first of all. I was not gonna vlog this, but, I mean, whatever. Well, it all started when... <laughs> okay. Um, so I woke up in Philadelphia at 4.30 a.m. to work a, uh, a Raleigh flight and then to San Juan, San Juan, back to Raleigh. Oh, I look absolutely insane. Okay. But yeah, I was supposed to do all of that. I'm still in Raleigh right now and I've been here for five hours. I, I didn't want to vlog nothing today because I thought thing I knew nothing was gonna go smooth because these big long trips I don't usually work long for their trips. This is a 25 hour trip. It's a like so many legs, so many flights, a lot of work. So I'm like I'm not vlogging this. <laughs> That's too much. It's not even gonna be entertaining. But I should have known. Well, I did know that it was not gonna go off without a hitch. So my whole entire trip is like starting off terrible. Been sitting here for five hours. My plane, we literally just flew the plane here and then something happened. I can't get into detail because <laughs> it's really nothing. Like, it's just little stupid stuff. But in my opinion, little stupid stuff. Anyways, um, I gotta update my schedule. So I was supposed to be laying over in Raleigh, Denver, Cleveland, and be done with Philly. I'm officially timed out and if y'all don't know what that means I cannot work past well I can't work past 14 hours a day but a new rule said that we can extend to 16 and get paid extra so I'm getting paid extra right now that's a good thing but another bad thing is that now I'm over 16 that's that's where I'm illegal okay I'm illegal I'm either gonna be stuck here in Raleigh or in San Juan so I'll update y'all later. So, in the meantime, while I was here for six hours, six hours, I managed to upload a whole new vlog. Oh my god, I got six minutes left. I'm so proud of myself. And that is the definition of no days off. Hard work and dedication, okay? Okay, I did this all on a six hour delay. Round of applause for me. Hopefully y'all enjoy it. It's super funny. I love this vlog. Mama's for Life episode six. Yep. Go watch it. And I'm about to board to uh, San Juan now and I get to stay there. So yeah, I'll catch up with y'all in San Juan. So, it's been a long day while I was in the air. Atlanta had some active shooter, shooter incident, something going on. I don't know. But now I'm stranded in San Juan because we can't get a hold of crew scheduling. And we don't know where we're staying at here yet. This is craziness. Like, what the heck? Where is this stupid post? They talking about us a, a active shooter, but it was a, actually a mistake. So we've been on hold, wondering what the heck is going on with us. They haven't updated our schedule or nothing. So I look a mess and I'm tired. <laughs> I did not want to vlog anything, but this is a crazy mess going on right now, y'all. Crazy mess. Oh, here it is. It's not an active shooter. But I guess just, uh, I don't know. That was today while I was in the air. <sighs> Whatever. Nothing gonna stop me from getting my my content uploaded, okay? Not, not being stranded, nothing, okay? We still stranded, by the way, too. to upload my pictures on time and make my vlog live yeah, I told you. it's the dedication for me yes
to stop getting scammed out here for real because now he about to get unfollowed <laughs> y'all need to stop falling for these cash app scams this is crazy this is crazy they taking y'all pages hacking y'all pages and i'm gonna following y'all okay don't don't fall for them scams i'm gonna following you all right <laughs> thank y'all thank you Bree. Okay, now this is actually getting ridiculous. We're still stranded. My crew outside, they sitting on the concrete. It's like 80 degrees outside. I come in here, I need to charge my phone. I didn't try, I didn't uh, try to find like 10 plugs in here. None of them work. Like this is, this is a nightmare. Okay, finally. Oh my God. I thought I was, oh, this is absolutely insane. I'm in Puerto Rico. Stranded. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is y'all seeing my ugly side right now. <laughs> I look crazy. <sighs> yes, 8:30. Now we don't have no hotel. Oh, I'm. I'm not. I'm like not joking. I'm just. I'm sitting on the freaking floor right now. This is the ugly side of being a flight attendant. Okay. This is it. Real and raw and cut. This is what can happen. Um, G, y'all. So my my girl just texted me, my crewmate. She said that we got 31 hours in Cleveland. Because you remember, I was supposed to go to Cleveland anyway. So I got to check my schedule to see if it's true. Like, what? I got 31 hours in Cleveland? I'm about to go. <laughs> I'm about to go home. Oh, my God. Oh my god, let me check my schedule, y'all. Alright, let me refresh. Oh my god, y'all, I'm still stuck in San Juan. See, I, I, I really am. I'm supposed to go to Cleveland on Monday. Now let me see what they about to do. I'm so excited. Is this true? Oh my god, there it is. Hold on. I go straight to Cleveland. The 30. I'll catch up with y'all later. I'm going to keep y'all updated on the time. It's about to be 9 o'clock in a minute. About to be 9 o'clock and we still don't have a hotel yet. So I'll keep y'all updated then. All right. so i finally made it to the hotel yeah y'all probably already seen this if you follow me on instagram this lovely hotel here but i already seen the view and i don't think i like it well of course i don't like it because we got whatever was left honey we was not supposed to be here at all i've never had this view before child then and gave me a view of the thing gone parking garage <laughs> Oh my god, I didn't even know this view existed. Oh child. But it's cool. I'm not even here that long, so. Oh, uh uh, uh uh. It's a moth out here trying to get in. I don't mess with moths, okay? So that's that. View of the straight parking garage. And <laughs> yeah. But trust me, anytime I'm here, I have a beautiful over water view. And this is like one of my favorite hotels. But since we're not here that long, it's fine. I really don't even, um, I'm not mad at all because I get to go to Cleveland tomorrow. 31 hours, y'all. What did I do to get so blessed? And you know what? I wasn't even going to vlog this trip. I knew it was going to be a messed up trip, but I thought it was going to be messed up in a way that's like, terrible like i thought we were just gonna be working 16 hour days every single day i didn't think none of this cool stuff would happen like a unexpected layover mind you this is still day one all of this on day one and tomorrow i was only supposed to have a tomorrow we were supposed to go to denver have 10 hours of sleep there and then cleveland have 12 hours of sleep there 
and then that would have been that would have been so boring but i just knew these big long trips like this they always get messed up that's why i work trips like uh these 25 hour trips four day trips i don't work these type of trips because something always happening but it worked out in my favor for once like <sighs> yeah my original trip is completely shattered um i'm not going to denver i'm not going to raleigh i'm going to cleveland tomorrow and i'm done i'm done and i'm getting paid for all of it so <sighs> finally worked out for me but anyways um uh, this is day one i'll catch up with y'all on day two okay so see y'all in the morning I'm back again just for a quick 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 nightcap I just wanted to get on here and just say that you can do anything you can do anything to put your mind and time to and I'm only saying that because lately I've just been feeling like I've been slacking with like being more consistent with my crafts and I just been feeling like nobody is ever gonna subscribe or like my stuff or you know continue to support me if I'm not consistent you know and I'll be beating myself up about it because I literally just do not be having the time and I'm always tired and all that negative talk you know I, lately I've been working on getting the word tired and not having enough time out of my vocabulary because Today, I worked for 16 hours straight. I woke up at 4.30 in the morning to go to work. This was supposed to be a 12-hour day. And I was delayed for six hours, and I still managed to upload a vlog. And that, and I've been doing that slowly, a lot lately, and I've really been so proud of myself. And, yeah, that's all I just wanted to get on here and say is that you can do anything that you put your mind and your time too. I need to stop saying I'm tired. I need to stop saying I don't have time because I do. And I thought that this job was taken like a few months ago. I wanted to quit. Like, because you know, I mean, I love being a flight attendant, but I really feel like I want to do more things in life. I know I, know I want to do more things in life because I, I always have and I never thought I could and I'm now just venturing into those crafts now so you know I want to do YouTube I want to make music I want to act I want to all types of stuff I want to just do that type of stuff but I feel like this job was just in the way but no don't what, what they say don't let your nine to five stop you you know your nine to five is supposed to support your dreams and what it does it does a lot <laughs> So that's how I make my money and I'm able to give y'all travel content and stuff like that so you know you you work your job during the day and still chase your dreams you know with the rest of the time you have because that, that's just what we gotta do it is what it is and I've been learning to just do that just do it no complaining no you're not tired no you're not nothing you're gonna do it because this is what you want to do okay so that's all I wanted to say um to end this night off um i'll see y'all in the morning i'm gonna take a walk around show y'all a little bit around of course and i'll see y'all hopefully in cleveland <laughs> tomorrow night so yeah see y'all in the morning good night
so I'm just about to sit here and get a tan, listen to the waves, and just relax because I didn't realize how much I needed this. And um, again, I'll be going to Cleveland tonight. Uh, I can't believe I didn't like come in here no more. I mean, I, I definitely overstayed my welcome a few times, <laughs> but it's always nice to come back sometimes because I need to realize this is what I uh, worked hard for. This is what um, I'm grateful for. And I need to take advantage. I need to take advantage of all my moments, all my time. So, yeah. That's pretty much it for um, this segment of the vlog, the San Juan segment. I'll see y'all a little bit later because I have two deadheads. If y'all don't know what a deadhead is, it's when I just sit there and get paid to fly. You know, I don't, I don't work. I sit in a regular seat and I just chill out. So that's what I'm going to be doing a little bit later. I only have like two hours left here, so I'm about to relax. And yeah, catch up with y'all later. For me to get out of here. I want y'all to say hello to my little friends every time I come here. These my little friends. Hello. You sleepy? It's too early. Okay, okay, friends. Uh oh, what'd you say? Hello? Hola? Hola? You tired of me? I ain't seen you in a long time, bro. What's wrong? Hola? Ah, he, he don't want to talk today. It's cool. have a little lunch before I go to work. I'm not like savvy with the Starbucks drinks yet, so I just got this passion fruit tea. I didn't do nothing special to it, so yeah. Got grilled cheese. Oh, it's grilled cheese. It's so buttery. And greasy. Ooh. So today is gonna be super, super easy. You know, I'm just gonna be chilling, eating my sandwich, drinking my Starbucks, and getting paid to do that. I got two flights today, two dead heads, where I'm just chilling, and I'm getting paid. That is like, this is like the second best trip ever. I'm telling y'all. I am so happy right now. But yeah, um, the sandwich is so good. Just waiting for my van and I'll see y'all wherever I see y'all. I go to Orlando and then from Orlando I go to Cleveland. So yep, catch up with y'all later.
y'all so i just made it to the orlando airport i didn't do nothing but sleep on that last flight y'all yes i was knocked out until this little crying kid woke me up god jeez i'm always by some ruckus every time i try every time i fly literally always never fails anyways um about to catch my flight to cleveland my airline got us dead heading on united airlines i have not flown united in a long time but i'm excited to just finally get home and yep that's it i'll catch up with y'all later when we get to cleveland Like, <laughs> we it's never a been here. <laughs> Y'all are embarrassing us, guys. We're used to nice things. <laughs> Another airline. <laughs> Y'all <are> funny. <laughs> Me and my crew on right now. I'm on the last row because it's a full flight. But yeah. <laughs> talking about how nice it is all the tvs and stuff we just wish we would have but it's cool it's cool we're scheduled uh, two hours to cleveland we're going to take off flight for two hours and get you all the beautiful blue little house the beautiful little house the made it to the Cleveland Hotel yes I said Cleveland Hotel because I'm not going home right now and it's because me and my partner is in a bigger mint right now I guess this is the end of the vlog I'm so sorry I apologize I'm just not happy right now I was so happy earlier yeah Anyways, um, I'll talk to y'all in the next flight attendant vlog. I got 32 hours here in my hometown. I'm just going to chill at the hotel. My God, with my crew, if I do, then I'll cut back on the camera. But if not, I'll talk to y'all in my next flight attendant vlog. Oh, I hate when I let stuff get to me. I was so happy to come home. But anyways... I'm getting paid to be here at least. Getting paid to be here. I like this hotel. We're we're near a lot of good stuff. A mall. I might do some retail therapy. Um, it's just a little bickerment. It's fine. Um, yeah. I'll talk to y'all later if I do anything fun. If not, thanks for watching. Love y'all so much. I appreciate all the love and have a good night. is 32 hours later i know i was supposed to vlog for y'all but you know what i ended up just enjoying my time at home i really did my um man came to visit me we just chilled out like i didn't even go home i stayed at the hotel and we just chilled out made a little fun time there so <laughs> um um i have one flight to uh, orlando florida right now uh <laughs> 
dang, my, my, my mind is gone. What's going on? Wake up. Um, I'll talk to y'all in the next flight attendant vlog. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. This was a crazy trip, y'all, but it actually worked out in my favor for once. I genuinely did not want to work. Ford equipment, good five seat belt extenders. Oh my god, that literally scared the crap out of me. It's too early. But anyways, I, I genuinely did not want to work this trip, but I'm so glad that I did because I just knew, like, I haven't worked a big trip like this in forever. You know, one where uh, I was supposed to work three legs every single last day. And I ended up only working nine hours of this 25-hour trip. Like, I was supposed to be working, working, okay? But I did not. I was deadheaded, 32 hours at home. It just was a blessing. So, um, that's enough of, of this flight attendant stuff. And I'll talk to y'all in my next vlogs. Happy holidays. And yeah.